Now the next game is this Saturday at the AJ Bell yep. against Scarlets. How do you think that match will go? Um, for us as a team, we really need to progress now. Uh, it's been a while since we've won. I'm not sure how many games it is exactly, but um, we need to win. Uh, it's desperate times really for us as a team. Uh, if we win this weekend, that'll be a massive step up for us. And then we can take that on into the Premiership. Um, so for us, we need to get our home winning streak back on track and uh, move forward. Now, this weekend's fixture is quite a milestone for you. You'll have your 6,000th minute of professional rugby. Oh, wow. What's been the highlight in that time for you? Um, playing at Salon twice was a massive highlight for me. Um, obviously, because the crowds are fantastic and playing one of the best teams in Europe, possibly the world, uh, is always a massive Massive experience. Uh, I remember my debut, starting debut against Worcester. That was a great game. I think we lost. Um, it was away. We lost by a few points. Can't remember the score, but I always remember that game, obviously, because it was my first start. Still got plenty of time in your career, of course, but last season saw you make your first appearance for the England Saxons. Do you have any more thoughts on how your individual career might continue to go? Um, yeah, you can never know, obviously, if the if anything happens in that respect, it's great. But for me at the minute, it's just focusing on sale, playing, with, playing well for sale and uh, dragging the team through this, through this patch run. One thing that's been particularly impressive in that time is that you've come through the academy structure of the team here. You're a North West lad playing for a North West club. Yep. What do you think about the structures that are being put in place to try and make sure there's more lads from the area in the sale team? Uh, it's really important for sale to obviously bring that organic players through from local areas. We've got big schools such as Lim, uh, Wilmslow, uh, who are producing lots of players through the academy. you just got to look at the starting 15 and how many of the boys are actually from down the road almost.